Let's take a look now about posting to a blog. The first thing you want to do is hit the large button at the bottom of the screen and this will take us to the new post screen. From here we can set up our new post. The first thing you want to do is choose which space it is that you're posting to. In this example I'm choosing the Inomed Economy post. And then you want to add a title to your post. After you've added your title, you can add some tags. These are just words that you can separate with commas to help find your post later on. Any tags you've used before will appear below in the list, but you can easily just add more. Remember to separate individual words with commas to make them into tags. And now you can add your description. This is basically the content of your post, the text that will make up the post. But maybe we want to add more than just text to our post. So let's tap the camera icon in the yellow bar and now we can see our latest pictures from our camera roll. You can just tap each image or video to add them as attachments to your post. As you add and remove videos, you'll see the number next to the camera icon change. If you want to add a new image or new video, tap the larger camera icon to open your device's camera. And if your pictures are stored not in your camera roll but in other albums, you can just touch the albums icon to view those. We can also add extra information to our post, uh, such as our location information. Uh, by turning it on, the GPS service locates you and you can add this so that your teacher knows where you made the post. The next icon on the yellow bar allows us to choose which space it is that we're posting to, just the same as we had above. The fourth is a sharing icon that if the post is not private, you can also make your post to Facebook or Twitter. And the last icon just minimizes and maximizes the keyboard. Once you're ready to send your post, just tap the send button at the top right and you'll see it shortly inside your space.